out of Penticton, played a season at Ohio State in a couple of games of his sophomore year. And now a breakaway chance here for Remy Lorenzo. Lorenzo finding the back of the net early on four on four. And Manitoba taking the early one nothing advantage. The poor decision, he's gonna try and get this puck over to his partner. He ends up just giving it away. We're gonna see a good move here. Ludwig Hoff now skating in. Hoff! Lost in a three-game series in the first round of the Canada West Conference playoffs. Pushing in now, Grant Mismash! Right in the left, the freshman! The second round pick for the Predators makes it 2-1 to UND. 61st overall pick in this spring's NHL draft. Spent the last season with the national team development program as Colton Pullman fires one in on Blake Byron Spriggs. Pesky, another one, stop down. He scrambled in front there. Nick Jones almost got a stick on it. Bison's scrambling a little bit here as UND putting the pressure on late in the first. Well, real good play there by Pesky to get that puck through. Dixon Bowen now skating in. Bowen putting the brakes on. Somehow did not find the back of the net that time. For Manitoba took the early 1-0 advantage. Dixon Bowen nearly made it three a moment ago. I'm not sure how that puck didn't find the back of the net. Well, real good play there by him putting the brakes on it. Mismatch. Over to Adams. Chance here for Adams. Leaving it in front. How about that on the backhand for Christian Milanen? The junior defenseman makes it 3-1 to one in North Dakota. Hey, look at this. He get, dishes that puck. Drives right up into the play here. This is a defenseman, folks. He's ahead of Mishmash, even, who's a winger. Real good. So the hot streak is carried over. Oh, this puck trickles by Johnson. A deflection right in front. Calvin Spencer put the puck in on net. Take a peek here. Right here, you're going to see. Oh, it was just a, a tip. Almost off of Josh oh, Dick. I was mentioning, instead of, I believe the direct quote was, instead of crushing a bag of chips, he's going for an apple. And Ludwig Hall has himself the second bite at the cherry tonight. Number 27 cleaning up on the rebound from the initial shot from Gersich, and it's 4 to 2. Quite the impression here so far for the sophomores. Gardner slides in. Remember, Hoff only had four goals all of last season. He's got two tonight in exhibition action so far. And pressing for more. Spriggs sprawling to make the save on Colin Adams in front. Humphrey, of course, rumored to be taking the Florida Panthers job in the offseason. He's back. No, a chance here in front for Manitoba. Johnson down. That shot does not cross the goal line. And the net gets pushed off the mooring. A deflection that time. And we'll see right here. I, I think it would have went in, but it hits Manitoba's stick. Here comes the call now officially, and it will be no goal. So the ruling on the ice will stand. It will remain a 4-2 hockey game with 7.36 left in the second. Spend that much time on the plane and that far away from home. Yeah. Josh Rieger now pushing forward. Kawaguchi finding the top shot! Paganski, Simonson, Pullman. Will land now with 10 seconds. Cross ice to Simonson! Johnny Simonson! Fourth career goal for number 10 against Manitoba, and it's 6 to 2 UND. So, four on four hockey for the second time tonight. A little extra open ice here for Austin. Paganski leaving it for Will Lannan. Paganski in front on the wraparound. Stopped on the doorstep there was Shane Gersich. Byron Spriggs able to scrawl and make the pad save just in front. Yeah, if you're going to the exhibition contest, certainly the one where you want to give it a try is Rainey Hunter fires one in. Told me a great job on the deflection. Still loose in front. Finally, Peter Tomey getting the glove on it. Their 16th straight victory over Manitoba. 16-0 all time against the Bisons in exhibition action. A comprehensive 6-2 win for the home team this evening.